It's 4 a.m. Look at the size of those snowflakes. It's melting quick, but we can certainly say that we saw some snow on the ground this winter. And we can't always say that. We probably really did have two inches. It's just that the surfaces were warm, so it melted on the way. It melted when it hit the ground, and then it melted from underneath after it accumulated. And But um, hey, they were right. It snowed. The Nandina berries are always extra pretty when there's a little bit of ice. It's uh, 33 and gusty, a little windy. No, it's not super pleasant out here this morning. Morris is up here behind Stripe. He gets excited about his food in the morning. He almost looks happy to see me for a minute. Hey bud, it's okay. Mr. Don's just trying to get some of that slush off of the boardwalk with the broom. Let's go. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, your, your, your towel is soggy and frosty. He likes to sit up there if we leave him a towel. Your food's in the other direction. You need to not come and cause any trouble. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Turn around. There you go. Don says, if anything, it's more slick now. <laughs> Oops. He was trying to make it safer and better for me and the kitties. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to sit this morning. It's actually still snowing just a little bit. Little tiny, tiny precipitation coming down. I need a driveway report on the safety of driving to meet Michelle at Guardian Angel. I think it's going to be okay, but I need a driveway report. Will you be careful now? The driveway looks... No, I don't think that cement hill is slick at 33 degrees. No possible way. Mm. Burr. What's the report on the driveway? Oh, yeah, the driveway. There was no icy spots or anything. The hill was fine. The street's fine. Okay. It's damp, but um, I would say it's perfectly safe to drive on. You know, be careful. I'll check on Facebook one more time to make sure they didn't close, but when I yeah. checked an hour ago, they had not. So the sun is out now, and it's the great fast melt off, which so often is the way snow works here in central North Carolina. We get it, it looks pretty, it melts, we go back to normal, which is why we often just handle things by just flat out stopping for a small amount of time, a day, an hour, and then going back. Hey bud, you're gonna have to get away from the garage door. The mom's gonna move the car, okay? There in the sun, you can kind of see the stuff coming down out of the trees quick. As Soon as the sun came out, I rushed down the driveway much faster than normal because all these ice pellets were falling on Ruby. It was kind of like small pea-sized pieces of hail. It's certainly possible that the town has put some sand down. Yeah, I see sand on the bridge down here, so I'm gonna go through the neighborhood to avoid that. I highly doubt there's much sand down, and they did not brine the roads prior to the event yesterday, which they would so often do, because uh, it rained. We had a lot of rain. It would have just gotten washed off, so they did not, they did not bother to brine the roads. I thought about taking the van. Don and I thought about taking the van and you know I just I just want to ride drive Ruby. I don't want to get sand on her. But um if I do, Don will wash her sooner than later and it'll be just fine. A little bit of sand once a year for 24 48 hours isn't going to be the end all of the car by any stretch. Clearing skies are pretty. I'm just continuing to record here for just a minute in case the Model Y is home. <laughs> and I would say it is not home right now. Yeah, I wonder what that's like to come out and unplug your car 
and your cable's got snow on it. Not something we would typically have to think about here in Central North Carolina. Now in the mountains that would be different, but here, no. I mean, here you probably really can have your Tesla outside all year round. It, it neither gets too cold and icy nor too hot to make it um, work well. Not saying it can't work well where it's cold and icy or really warm, but you know, you're not gonna, probably wouldn't notice reduced charging speeds in the summer here because your cable's too hot, not like in Arizona maybe. I just used Ruby to send Don a message to let him know that I avoided the bridge. Um, I have to say I've been receiving and using um, the messaging. Don Miller says, has sent me a smiley face. Be nice if she read that. Um, I was just going to uh, brag on the messaging. It's been great lately with the changes they've made, uh, stacking the messages, and I finally figured out how to use it, pressing the button and, ooh, saying the right things. There's a big chunk of ice fell off um, the, um, fell off the uh, street light. Anyway, messaging is working great and I'm using it more now. I know some people say that people tell them they don't sound good in the car or it doesn't work for them. I, I guess I wish um, maybe Tesla would put in some sort of a debug checking, a little more quality assurance on it. I, I mean, I think it can work great. I'm sure in a few cars something is not um, exactly how you'd want it to be. But um, it's working great for me. It's working great in Ruby. I never had to have anything repaired. It just works well. It's just like a watercolor sky this morning. It's very pretty. I probably should point Ruby away from the signpost over here and see if the dash cam time lapse is worthwhile. It takes me just a minute more to back in and make sure I'm the appropriate distance from those metal posts. That is a very deep, a very long parking space so um i i got away from the trees because there's ice falling um so i don't have to get super close to the metal is that a model three or a y in front of us i'm sure that it is the white car um yeah it's a three i do have to look for a second or two to figure it out for sure but no black at the bottom and the roof line is too low. But it has gotten a little harder for me to tell as of late. Well, I see Michelle. I see people waiting to get in. I mean, there was no reason to close. I do not think it was unsafe for staff to report this morning. I never want them to open if they feel it's safe for my unsafe for my friends to get to work. But, um today I think it was perfectly safe. I wouldn't have been upset had I worked here and been asked to come in this morning. I parked Ruby a little farther away from the post than normal so if there's any ice up there it falls. Hopefully it won't hit her. I think it'll be fine. I don't know if Michelle's seen me yet or not because the guardian angel truck was there. Well it's not looking super crowded this morning. So maybe a few extra people are home coming out later in the day because of the weather. It will all be melted very soon. Are you up on me? No! Well, if you wouldn't park so close, you'd know where I was. <laughs> Everybody go inside. Did you see them open? Oh, I didn't see anybody. But I, I, I did check Facebook and didn't see that they were closed, mm -hmm. so no real reason to. I think people are going to just be staying away because of this horrible weather we're having. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you know, a girl from Pittsburgh, what are you going to do? Yep, exactly. We're used to all of that, and this is nothing. This I, is never learned, I never learned to drive in it, so okay. I don't know what I'm doing. So I stay home when it snows. So they're opening a little late at 11. We'll come back. I guess we're going to go look for, for po the Pokemon killers. <laughs> Want me to come with you? Or? Yeah. Huh? We're yes. back at Guardian Angel. It's going on 1130. We played Pokemon. Michelle drove us around. I helped her with her collection challenge and explained how that works. And 
you know, Michelle's in it, and, and it's a good thing to be for the cute Pokemon. And she likes playing with me when I'm around. And she does, you know, collect them when I'm not around. But, you know, all the subtleties of raiding and that kind of stuff, um, she may not uh, care about, care about. So is this side still not open? No, it is. They just didn't take the sign down. Michelle's going to get this doll very different looking. Michelle's got her baby doll. <laughs> Call that animal? I think it was a lion. Well, it's supposed to be a horse, I guess. A or horse or a lion. A lion. It, it looks homemade. Very nicely done. Sanded down, no splinters. Sturdy with that rounded seat. That would make a nice photo off. I'm not yeah. going to buy it, but I love the Cabbage Patch Kid astronaut with the little helmet and everything. That is so cool. I bet you know somebody that could make use of that, Michelle. <laughs> Things you see that make you laugh. Here you go, Michelle. This describes you and Sean perfectly. <laughs> I think I will. Needs a good washing, but it's only two bucks. Perfect for the theater room. Comfortable as it looks? Yeah. It looks really comfortable. On this one? <laughs> Wearing around the lamp for that shade. It's only four dollars and it's I mean it's gorgeous, it's perfect. It's not discolored, it's not cracked on the inside. For wow. those really difficult school days. Yes, poor area. Lots of toys to choose from, but no Lego bricks. Pouting. If ever there was one to go to your house, such a sweet, cute little guy. So sweet and cute. <laughs> Connor. <laughs> well, it's 2.08. Of course, we met at 10.30, but then didn't really go into Little Angel until 11.20 because they were delayed opening today. Um, it's uh, 35 out there, so it hasn't warmed up at all. And the winds now are like at 25 mile an hour at least. It almost blew my face mask off my face, um, the shield, as I was walking to the car. It was just, oh my God, it's cold. The wind, the wind uh, is horrible now. It's supposed to be 24 tonight that I say that. A lot of the ice has melted. Most of it has melted. Johnny does have Taekwondo tonight, but given this serious wind out here, I just feel better if Ruby was in the garage and I'll just pull Ruby back out before his 7 p.m. class. Tuxie wanted some attention, so I brought him inside for a few minutes of supervised house time. Hey, buddy. Tux, don't get down. It's too cold for mom to be out there in that wind, and I didn't want to ignore his request. This is easy. This is good. Good for my back, good height.